Let me ask you a personal question. How often do you look at yourself in the mirror? And brushing your teeth and combing your hair doesn't count. I'm talking about looking at every inch of your skin. The reason I'm asking is because I just read a study about how skin cancer survivors don't regularly check their skin. Many of the patients said they didn't know what to look for. They also said their doctors never told them they should be doing a skin check at home. This is another potentially deadly example of mainstream doctors falling short when it comes to how they care for their patients. So once again, you need to be your own advocate. You should be doing regular skin checks regardless of whether or not you've ever been diagnosed with skin cancer before. And you should be doing them even more frequently if you have been diagnosed with skin cancer. In case you're not familiar with it, here's the general A, B, C, D, E rule for detecting melanoma. A, asymmetry, the spot isn't a perfect circle. B, border irregularity, edges of the spot may appear notched or bumpy rather than smooth and even. C, color, a spot that appears mottled or is more than one single shade. Also, brown and black aren't the only colors to look for. Melanoma can be pink, tan, or even white. D, diameter, spots over a quarter of an inch. E, evolution, the spot has grown larger or changed color over time. If you find something that looks suspicious, don't wait to have it checked out. Catching melanoma early could save your life. For a detailed guide on cancer-proofing your entire body, inside and out, check out my report, Cancer Free for Life. You can learn more about it by clicking on the link below. Till next time, I'm Dr. Fred.